Good morning. Today is Wednesday, October 30th. I'm Corva Coleman from NPR News, and here are today's top stories. There's less than a week to go before Election Day. Former President Donald Trump held a rally last night in Allentown, Pennsylvania. He says the U.S. has turned into a dumping ground for people entering the country illegally. I'm going to protect our women from criminals coming into our country and going up to the suburbs and doing really bad things. We're going to protect our men, our women, our children. We're going to protect our country 100 percent protect our country. The FBI's latest data show violent crime in the U.S. has fallen significantly recently. Stanford University researchers say that since the 1960s, immigrants have been 60 percent less likely to be incarcerated than people born in the U.S. Vice President Kamala Harris gave a major speech last night on the ellipse in Washington, D.C. The White House was illuminated in the background. Harris contrasted her career with that of Trump, saying she has worked to protect Americans. For decades, as a prosecutor and a top law enforcement officer of our biggest state, I won fights against big banks that ripped off homeowners, against for-profit colleges that scammed veterans and students, against predators who abused women and children and cartels that trafficked in guns, drugs, and human beings. Harris gave her speech on the same spot that then-President Trump used on January 6, 2021, to talk to his supporters. After that speech, some of the Trump supporters in the crowd attacked the U.S. Capitol. Former President Trump campaigns in North Carolina and Wisconsin today. Vice President Harris is also in North Carolina. Then she will visit Pennsylvania and Wisconsin. Former President Trump and his allies are going after a remark by President Biden last night, where Biden appeared to call Trump supporters, quote, garbage. As NPR's Tamara Keith reports, this comes after a controversy following a Trump rally in New York, where a comedian referred to Puerto Rico as a, quote, floating island of garbage. Biden was on a video call with the group Voto Latino talking about the Trump-backing comedian's widely panned joke about Puerto Rico when he said this. They're good, decent, honorable people. The only garbage I see floating out there is his supporters, his his. His demonization of seen as unconscionable. Biden promptly tweeted out a clarification, saying he was talking about the, quote, hateful rhetoric about Puerto Rico spewed by Trump's supporters at his rally, and not Trump's supporters broadly. But by then, Trump and his allies had already expressed outrage and demanded an apology. Trump hasn't yet apologized for what was said at his rally on Sunday. Tamara Keith, NPR News. You're listening to NPR News from Washington.